Did you ever notice um, that it's kind of relatively easy to learn chords from the song, right? But it's not that easy to remember the rhythm. And the question is, what's happening? Why is that? Or is it normal to kind of to face this kind of the problems? And the thing is, I notice myself that it's much easier just to learn the chords than to learn the rhythm. Because the rhythm is something that you have to make yourself familiar with, OK? The way I am working on the songs is that um, it takes me sometimes two or three days before I will be able to play um, the song, like easy song with, with kind of the rhythm. It's not because the song is particularly difficult, it's because this is how long it takes for me to memorize the rhythm itself. So for instance, when I'm working on the song, um, one day I'm just laying the chords, and I may try to memorize the string pattern on, let's say I'm working on the kind of the guitar lick with some kind of the rhythmical, you know, thing going on. One day I, I may try to learn this, and um, I memorize this, I can play this stuff, I put the guitar on the side, I come back to the guitar next day, and I have to literally learn this again. And then again, I've learned this, I can play this, I put the guitar on the side, on the third day, again I have to learn this stuff. And maybe on the fourth day I remember how to play this song. And this is actually the part of learning, this is kind of learning process that is happening. And this is normal, we kind of learn, we forget, we learn, forget, and eventually it stays with us. So if you notice that, um, that you don't remember the rhythm, this is normal. Everybody is, is facing the same issues when it comes to learning songs, okay, or learning the solos. So one way to work on this problem will be to listen to the song that you are working on, or to the guitar league, or whatever you are working on. Listen to this over and over and over again until you'll be able to hear this in your head. So for instance, you'll be able to, when I have, let's say, the league, like... It's a very simple example, of course, but... Um, you know, I, I want to listen to this, so I actually I can recreate the same melody in my head. Because only then I will be able to pick up the guitar and comfortably play this stuff. Okay, so, so remember, it's a good idea to listen, for instance, um, if you are trying to learn the song, to listen to the song, focus on the rhythm part, listen to what the guitar is doing, and try to make yourself familiar with this stuff, okay? Um, it, will save, it will save you a lot of frustrations, okay? Because um, Usually, um, learning the, the rhythm part is always the, um, the, the most difficult, okay? So, so what I'm trying to say is that if you are one of these uh, people that, that is kind of looks like it's, it, you can learn the chords, but you don't remember the rhythm, remember, this is absolutely normal, and everybody's facing the same problems. This is why, you know, bands, big bands, before they go on the, on the, on the tour, what they do, they lock themselves in the um, rehearsal rooms, and they rehearse the material for like maybe four, five, six months. They have to basically think about that way. What do they need to do? They have to learn really many times what they recorded on the album because they keep forgetting stuff. So they have to normally take the stuff, learn these songs again before they will be able to comfortably perform this on the stage. This is how it works, okay? So keep this in mind. This is why the bands need to prepare for the tour, because they need to memorize their own songs again, okay? And this is normal. So just, you know, a few words um, that, that hopefully um, will help you um, kind of keep going um, for these tough days when you feel like, oh, there's something wrong with me. I can't play the song. I don't remember um, the song. One tip of advice is also I can, that I can give you is, um, when you are working on the, on, the, on the song and you nail your strumming and you can play this strumming, try to record yourself on your phone or something. Because on the next day you may try to play this, listen to what you did the day before, it will be much easier to recall how this strumming was performed. Okay, So you can kind of um, help yourself by, by making recordings of your own playing. It will make really your life much easier. Okay, So this is what you may, um, what you may try to to kind of the solve the problem with um, um, with, with this um, with this rhythm part, okay? If you have any questions or something is not clear, you can always email me. Visit my website guitarcouch.com, uh, fill out contact form, and um, ask me the question. And I try to do videos like this, okay? So so hopefully it will help you, um, you know, master the guitar quicker and and um, in a happy, you know, fruitful way. Okay? So have a great day, and don't forget to practice the guitar today.